Hello again, this is Robert Veach here. This is my video review of the Manscaped brand, the Toolbox 4.0. has a lawnmower 4.0 electric trimmer, the Weed Whacker nose and hair trimmer, the Plow 2.0, the Shares 4-piece luxury nail kit, and the toiletry bag. Now we're going to go over everything and show you how it all works and what it looks like because this is a very extensive kit and you're going to love all the capability that this kit has. Let's take a look at the Shares 2.0. This is an all new luxury four piece nail kit featuring tempered stainless steel tools and a compact case made of premium PU leather. It's corrosion resistant long lasting design keep nails clean on the go with the included travel case. So here it is out of the nice packaging. Look how fancy this looks. It's called this it's got a soft stitched synthetic leather on here and it has magnetic latch holding this thing down really nice looks just beautiful you can see the polished stainless steel on all the components in here and you see the sides are stainless steel also that's holding this all together let's take these out and look at what's included so it slides right out so that you can gain access to everything on here so the first thing I see is a nail file, very nice, and it's got a good feel to it for doing your nails, and you can feel it's got the pattern on there that's going to cause you to be able to smooth out your nails, and then look at this nice cutter right here, and you see it's got a little safety tip on the end there so that you don't poke yourself so it's very safe. Very precision feeling for cutting nails. And then you have the more traditional nail cutter. You lift this up like that. Oh, so this has, this has a file built into it. See the manscape right on there. And then you have the nail clipper right there. Very nice very sharp and then this allows it to collapse back down and when you're finished using this you can push this down right here and then this collapses on it and holds it in place just like that then we have a nice pair of precision tweezers and uh, it's got a nice flat head on there i like that so it's not really sharp it's not going to go into you and cut you and this is great for removing any hairs you might have nose hairs or eyebrow hairs that that nature nice quality and i already tried this it worked really well it's got a really accurate tip on there uh, that allows you to really grab things nicely and then when you're finished using it you could just put it all slide it all down like that the magnetic holder on here holds it in place beautifully for you. This company was tired of trying to find the right tools to the job, so they engineered their own blade. Let's take a look at this. It says, welcome to the Manscaped movement. And there it is, all nicely packed. And it has a little package right here with three included blades on there. We're going to show a close-up of this, how it works. So you can see that you could tighten or loosen this. You go counterclockwise to loosen it. And then this whole piece comes off. Let's take a look. You got the, the weighted base right there. It's got a nice knurled end on there, which really feels good. And then you have the top, a bolt on there, and the bottom. And you see this got the ridges on there. And then if you take the blade itself, Looks like a little tiny little envelope. And then it's wrapped in paper. These are always micro thin and really sharp. So we're gonna take this and we're gonna place it over that nut and those two 
holder sections right there. And then we're going to take the bottom plate and line it up just like that. Then we're going to take the bottom handle and turn it clockwise and tighten that in place. And now you see, if you look at the profile right there, it has the blade right there. Now what's interesting is a lot of times single blades aren't shaped like this. If you look at the profile of it, but let me tell you, this works. Uh, your hairs line up with that and go in that little slot and then it cuts beautifully. Now this is extremely sharp. So be careful, you have to get used to it. Maybe you want to use a cream when you're shaving, but I tested this and it works really well to really get a really close shave, unbelievably close. It's a really cool product and it has a nice feel to it. It's got a nice heavy weight feel to it and it does slide around with that nice knurling on there that they added. Okay. It's got synthetic leather, PU leather, and you can use it as a bathroom travel bag for shaving kit and trimming bag. This is a premium quality travel and storage. It gives you a discreet place to handily store all your Manscaped refining products between grooming sessions. Perfectly sized to keep under the sink or take with you for easy on-the-go grooming. Made of sturdy PU leather, it's good looking and it feels really high quality. It's got that real leather feel to it. So you can keep your trimmer, your razor, any Manscaped formulation safe from loss and spillage in this water resistant zip bag. So I'm going to show you what I use it for right now and also all the storage that's inside here. So this company just makes some really cool stuff. The shed is high quality, sturdy, premium manufactured and features a compact 9 inches by 4 inches by 6 inch size. So it's travel, travel friendly, water resistant, has a lined interior, grab and go handle right here and you can see it unzippers really nice right there. So when you're charging it, that blinking LED as I showed, it gives you a status. So when it's blinking, it's actually charging as you'd expect. And it goes solid when it's fully charged. And that lets you know that it's finished charging. And then if it's blinking when you're using it, it means that the battery is low, it'll blink and let you know that you have to charge the unit. So let's take a close up look at this Manscaped Weed Whacker. Very simple to use, you just push that button and it comes on, you see the LED comes on right there. Listen how quiet it is. And then you just push it again to turn it off. Now you can run this underwater, the whole thing is waterproof. So you can even use this while you're taking a shower. And you could rinse this head to get the hair out, and you can even run it while you're rinsing it to flush the hair out. And if you want to replace the head or let it air dry, you just turn this counterclockwise and it comes out. You hear a snap there. And then if you want to replace the head, they suggest about every three, four months, you just get a new replacement head and it lines up just like that. And you turn it clockwise and you're all set. Very simple to operate. So the Weed Whacker also comes with a nice cleaning brush. So after you have used it, you can turn it counterclockwise and remove it. And then you could use this cleaning brush to get inside and remove any of the hair because it kind of goes right inside there nicely. And then you can rinse this in your sink or like I mentioned, you could rinse it while it's being used. Whichever way you want to do it, every way it works best for you. But they do include a nice little cleaning brush. Now I'm going to try this out. I have a Panasonic unit that's going bad and when they start to get dull or they don't work that well, they start to pull your hairs out really painful. So I'm going to pay close attention how this works and see if it comfortably removes any nose or air hair that I have. The manual does show that there is an optional accessory to get a charging dock so that you can just sit this in a dock and I'll have the link for that in the description so that you can purchase that also if you'd like. There's something else I want to discuss which is really important about this product. If you look at nose hair trimmers, there's only a few companies that make chargeable ones. It seems like like 90% of them you have to use batteries 
and they always use one AA battery. And that means that the motor inside there is a high current motor to handle that low voltage. That's just something how the power works out for a motor. So because this is using probably a 3.7 volt lithium ion battery, it means they had to redesign the motor in here to be a higher voltage motor, lower current. That means the motor runs more efficient and you don't have to worry about changing batteries. And any time I've ever used the battery versions, the battery always seems to be dead and then it starts pulling your nose hairs out. This is not, it's not gonna happen with this Manscaped product. You're gonna be able to use this thing and it has a long run time and you'll be able to keep it charged and have it ready all the time. That's an important difference between this product and what else is on the market right now. Now after you've used this, you will notice that you feel a little warmth on the head right there and that's normal. So if I do a thermal gun right here, you can see it's about 82 degrees. That's totally normal because the blade is rotating really close to that chromed piece right there and that's creating friction and heat totally normal and, it, and that's part of the process of why you could cut your hair so fine without any pulling or tugging now i'm going to show you a shaver that i own that they said was safe for your body safe for below the belt i tried this and it was a bloody nightmare I literally had blood drops all over my floor and I was being really careful. So I'm very interested in trying the Manscaped unit and see how it does because I'm a little paranoid now. <laughs> but I want to show you something. Turn this on and I have an orange right here. And the obvious reasons why this is shaped similar to what's below your belt. Now if I go with this right here you can hear the sounds making and it is literally it's lifting up on the flat part it's lifting the actual orange it's cutting into it this is sharp like a razor blade this thing will cut off a skin tag if you're not careful so this is not safe for below your belt it's not even safe for any part of your body really so let's just turn this Manscaped unit on and let's just compare it. So I'm pushing just as hard and you notice it's not stalling because it's not cutting in to the orange. And I'm pushing, I'm pushing very hard to have it dig in. And you notice it's not digging in. It's trying to remove whatever little bit on the surface is there, but it's not cutting in to that orange so there's your difference right there that's a basic demonstration right there now my wife begged me not to show this but i went through the trouble to make it so i'm going to show it <laughs> this is the anatomy we're talking about most men know what i'm referring to here and the reason i did this is because i want to explain what's important to use this product so this these creases represent the skin compression that is in there normally and this part right here we know expands and if you were to shave this part right here and you were to go this direction you're running a slight risk of going into these creases right here of your skin with this so you want to go in this direction for this area now on the base there is a conversion and it starts to go vertically and you don't want to go this direction you want to go this direction there and then here it's kind of like you want to go 45 degrees because it's a combination of that plus that the angles so 45 degrees you want to go right here then it transitions again as men know like that and you don't want to go this direction, you want to go 45, you want to go 90 degrees to the folds, just like that. Now speaking of folds, you want to open those folds up as best you can when you are shaving uh, 90 degrees to those folds. So you know what I'm referring to, you want to open these creases up as you're going 90 degrees to the creases 
or 45 degrees, 90 degrees, or 90 degrees right there. So that's just a demonstration to help you out so that you feel more confident using the Manscaped shaver. So I'm gonna try and demonstrate here that not only does this be used below your belt, I've got a little stubble right here. So I'm gonna try and use the lawnmower from Manscaped. And you can hear the sound is making. Now I'm looking at a monitor with a reversed image. So it's kind of hard for me to show what I'm doing here. But you get the idea. It is shaving just that little bit of stubble that's on my face. That's why it's so hard to do it properly when I'm you got a reverse image here. But uh, you get the idea. Not only to be used on your private parts, but on your face also. And you know, that worked really well. And, uh, and then I can put the attachment on here. And I could go to six, let's see, I can go to uh, about eight millimeter setting with the included attachment on there. On the lawnmower. And I could do the side of my hair right here. So after testing and using this product, what do we think about the Manscaped brand, the Toolbox 4.0, which has a lawnmower 4.0, the weed whacker, nose and hair trimmer, the plow, the shears, the four-piece luxury nail kit, the shed toiletry bag. This is a complete kit and you can't go wrong with the product that's high quality. As I demonstrated, all of this stuff really works really amazing. I'm impressed with the engineering of this product because everything works as they say in the listing. So this is a great value and I think you're really going to like it if you're a guy. And if you're a lady, I think you're going to like using these products too. So I'm going to give this kit, the Toolbox 4.0, a full 5 star rating. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you alert to new video uploads. And if you thought this review was helpful, please hit the like button. There will be an ordering link where you can order this great kit in the information section of this video review. Please use that link when you order to help support this channel. I hope this video review helped you with your buying decision. Thank you for watching.